Yes. Is this a recording? Hello my friend, here's Bayan with Bayan Reno. In this video I'm just gonna show you guys how to do some safe and sound isolation. This is for the sound and uh, for the combustion too. So this is the good stuff, Roxel safe and sound. I'll show you pretty much all the tools that I'm gonna use. I'm just gonna use this knife. I don't think I would need anything else to do it. It's just a knife and pretty much about it. Yeah, I'm just gonna use one knife and put this isolation up in on time and then we just keep moving right let's work i love you guys yeah guys and it is a good idea to wear a mask a glove right i'm just gonna put this glove on and go from there and i can use this piece of care channel to push it up to the seal because this is 10 feet and Let's work. And this one here guys is just simple, I not uh, have a tape on hand right now. All I do to cut the 24, measure it very much halfway, see the way it goes it work. And this is a 24 this way and 24 the other way. So I can just do this way here. Cut it.
Yes, my friend, here we go. So here's uh, how you do the isolation. This is a uh, safe and sound isolation, Roxas. So it goes very good to start 24 inches apart. So you just get a fit it good and it just stay there very good. Let me show you. You guys can see here. It just fit in right in the steel stud in there. It doesn't fall off. And we go from there. On the track we have acoustic caulking, so it's very much sound. And uh, we're gonna have two layers of dryer. We're gonna have the isolation. We have the acoustic caulking. And then we're gonna have this guy's right? Double five eighths dryer on this wall. So it's just gonna be good. We have the other side of the wall. We already have double five. Right now we're just gonna put the isolation up on this side and wait for inspection. Yeah, we left a little passageway in here. Cross to the other side because we don't have the key for that door. So until the key come we just have to leave a way to pass by there we go this is the wall we have Mr. Rick going crazy on it we're just gonna put finish coat today we just this is concrete fill Oh, we're just gonna finish here a few hours and then we start with the finished coat. It's gonna look good, guys. Double five eighths dryer. We had Mr. Rick here putting all this stuff up. The man is strong. There he goes. Look that. I just show you how to do isolation for a soundproof wall and that was fire because this is safe and sound. This is very good for both for the sound and for fire protection. Once we have the dryer on top of it, there we're just gonna put a Fire cock against the concrete, the slab, and like you guys can see, this is about 10 feet high. I not even to use a step hose or anything to go there, I just put the isolation. Use this piece of a care channel to push it up. Care channel piece of left over from this one that we put to stabilize the wall. Let's go from there. Guys, let me keep going here, because I still have the rest of this wall to finish. I'm gonna bang it up very soon. We go from there. I love you guys. And if you want to see more great videos, just uh, subscribe and leave your comment. If you have any question, please write down below. Thank you very much and see you on the next video. I love you guys.